What's good? What's good? What's good? Twitch, what's going on? Y'all see what's going on. First stream back in this bitch. Let me turn the cold down. You know what I'm saying? I had to had to turn up right quick, y'all. So what's good? YouTube, Twitch, y'all already know what's going on. It's your boy Kai for real. Back again with another banger for you guys. Um, you guys, man, I don't know if y'all on Twitter, whatever y'all on, y'all already know Twitter is really, I'm going to keep it a band. It's really probably the like top, 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 top best social media in the game, especially when you want to get some juicy shit like, you know what I'm saying? That, that shit you can't get on, you know, shit like Facebook and shit like Instagram because, you know, they be filtering shit. So this shit unfiltered, you know what I'm saying? Going crazy. As you can see in the title, bro. There was a list on Twitter going around saying this is what straight men can't do and this is what they can't do. I'm not even sure how this came. Well, I think actually I do know how it came about. So let's let's go ahead and find this jump right quick. So yeah, real what's going on, butter? All right, so look, this is this is what happened, y'all. So I don't know if y'all know who Saucy Santana is, bro. He a gay dude. FYI, ain't nothing wrong with being gay, you know what I'm saying, to each their own. This is just a, uh interest, interesting take on it. Baddie. Okay, hold on. They say so. Them girls. All right, so this is this how it so. started. Them girls ain't wrong. Them girls is not wrong. If you was the man, you don't need to be smoking a hookah, baby gal. You need to be brought you up a wood. Wait, so niggas is, I, apparently can't smoke hookah, bro. That's 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 that's, that's where he going with this. I'm, it's crazy that this is where this list came from. But let's you keep need going. To smoke you some za. Okay, you don't need to be sucking down a hookah, baby. <laughs> I'm a kid of Ben. I'm glad that I don't smoke hookah personally. Cause I would low key feel insulted, bro. But he's calling you you dudes who do smoke the hookah, he's calling y'all baddies. You know what I'm saying? I mean y'all gonna have to take that up with him. It's not really my problem, you know, it's not really my space to really say nothing. But let's let's keep watching. You was a man. You know, and unless you was a gay, unless you gay, like a gay boy, that's the only reason. I'm, that's the only way I'm letting you smoke hookah. If you not no gay boy, you a, a man. Put the hookah down. Put the hookah down and pick you up a grabber. Not with that. So say so. Them girls ain't wrong. Them girls is not wrong. Okay, so according to him, you should not be smoking hookah if you a man. And this like made this whole debate on like what straight men can and can't do. I feel like smoking hookah like I mean this is what this is what I will say before we really get into it. Like I feel like dudes are I don't know why straight men are like people act like they gotta be like some type of robots or like they can't do like you know what I'm saying everyday shit. Like they can't have emotions. Now apparently they can't smoke hookah. You know what I'm saying? Like what what can we do? You feel me? Um let's let's let's, let's get into what we can't do, bro. First thing on the list, smoke hookah. Um now y'all see what he said. Um how do y'all feel about that? How do y'all feel about that? Now y'all see oh, what shit. he said. How do y'all feel about that, y'all? I personally feel like that's that needs to be taken off the list, bro. Like that's that's just dumb. You can smoke hookah, my nigga, and it, and it don't make you it don't make you a girl. Okay, let's just scroll right up because that one is dumb, bro. Drink pink lemonade is the second one. All right, now I'm feeling like they, whoever made the list, they they trying to troll a little bit. You feel me? Um, because come on, bro. It's a drink, bro. You feel me? Like, what? what's wrong with drinking that? Anyways, next one. Watch Euphoria. Hey, I'm going to keep it, Ben. This one is funny to me. Because I watch Euphoria. Proudly. 
You feel me? And I'm not going to stop watching Euphoria. And if that make me not straight, that's some bullshit. Cause, <laughs> because the show is good, bro. Like, the show is good, bro. I don't know if y'all have watched Euphoria before, but basically, it's like, what's that girl name? Zendaya. You know what I'm saying? Doing her thing. She's like a drug addict on the show. There's a lot of like sexualized stuff going on. Gay stuff. Straight stuff. All type of shit. You know what I'm saying? Again, preference, sexual preferences, which is all good. Like, let people have their sexual preferences. That's cool. I don't understand why though, like people coming for like straight. You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like the community, they be, I, what is it LGB? TQ, I think. Don't don't get mad at me for butchering it if I did. But why y'all could come for, for straight people like that? That's crazy. Let the niggas drink. Let let us watch Euphoria, bro. Anyways, that one hit that one hit close to me. That was the first one that I really did. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Next one. Use an umbrella. Come on, bro. Use an umbrella. Come on, bro. That's like, like we 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 on a different level of reaching right now. You feel me? Like it's like you know what I'm saying. Some people, you know what I'm saying, they got their arm out just halfway, and then other people they just reaching to the moon and shit. Come on, bro. This don't even make sense, bro. So I gotta get rained on. I gotta be soaking wet out this bitch. Like if it rains, I gotta be soaking wet, and that's just that's just the way it is. Like they could have put some clarity. Maybe they said like the way I hold my umbrella, or you know what I'm saying, some shit like that. But just having an umbrella in general is kind of crazy to me, bro. I'm just saying. Like whoever's making this list, <sighs> the reaching is is really crazy right now. <sighs> Wear a scarf. Bruh. I'm not gonna lie. It's certain stuff like it I think the scarf would depend on how you wear it. It don't make you neither gay or straight though, but I think it can make you look a little zesty if you wear it a certain way, you feel me? Like it, it hold on, let me go let me go get my scarf, bruh. Alright, so I think that it's the way you wear the scarf that could make you look a little you know what I'm saying? So this is how I will wear this is how I wear my scarves, right? Straight like that. You feel me? Straight hanging, swaggy, you feel me? You feel me? That's how I wear my jones, right? I think that you kind of get the bombastic side eye. You feel me? Like that side eye, when you start doing all, you know what I'm saying, this with it. You know what I'm saying? And it's like hanging like that. Or, you know, you know, some people, some of y'all, you got to lead this to the, like, nigga might do this with it. Now, this is questionable activity. I'm not going to lie. Like, if I seen you wearing your scarf like this, I'm going to look at you and I'm going to say, I don't know, my nigga. I don't know. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm not really sure where we headed at this point. You feel me? Not really sure, can't really tell. So, I feel like it's the way you wear your scarf. Do you feel me? All right, so that one's out of, out of here. Drink any alcoholic drink that tastes good. You know, this is, I actually have a funny story about this one. So, me and my boys was at this party, right? It's all my niggas that I hoop with, play basketball with, da da da. And this is like the first. This is a long time ago. This is like the first time all of us really got together and really did some shit, right? Like, like I have a party. You feel me? So we have a party. You know, everybody talking and shit. Like, yeah, I could drink. I go crazy. You know what I'm saying? I hold my liquor. This that. You know what I'm saying? The third. Cool. Cool. When you saying that. To me, it's like, all right, you give me, boom, shot of Patron, boom, shot of Henny. You're going crazy with that. Like, you, you're going crazy with it. 
You feel me? You know what I'm saying? You taking boom, boom, three, three, four shots of each. And you you not hitting that like, sh you know what I'm saying? You not hitting that shit. You good, right? So why? Me and my niggas, we, we drinking. Boom. You know what I'm saying? And one of my homies, bro, like it's crazy out of the middle of the function, bro. Everybody's drinking, da da da. But it goes to the cooler. Granted, he didn't know this was because it was girls there and stuff. He didn't know this cooler was for the females. You feel me? He goes to the cooler. Goes in there. You know what I'm saying? Walking, walking, walking. Opens the cooler. Bro pulls out some hypnotic, right? I don't know. It, it was one of the moments where we got to call Cap, you know what I'm saying? On like, you, you said you was turning up and shit, right? It was one of the moments we had to call Cap, bro. So, essentially what happened was he pulled the hypnotic bottle off the jump and said, held that bitch up like this. And said, Okay, I found this uh -uh. on the web for how deep is a lighter. What Check are it you out. talking about? Shut up, Siri. Anyways, he pulled that joint out and was like, am I wildin'? A bottle of hypnotic. Bull said, am I wildin'? What do you mean? That's sweet. Like, if you drunk hypnotic before, if you haven't, it's just, it's a sweet drink. It's basically what what females, they, they usually, women do drink. You know what I'm saying? And that's cool. If you a nigga and you like the sweet drinks, that's cool. All that to say, let's, let's swear back to the original point. Straight men can drink that shit. I, it, if you're drinking around other dudes, it may make you look a little soft. But you can drink it, bro. And you can be straight doing so. Oh my God. This one right here is probably one of the biggest ones. Eating a banana hole. Right? All right. So, eating a banana hole, bro. I'm going to keep it a band. I have a, I have my, one of my friends, bro. It's hilarious, bro. And we hoop all the time. You know what I'm saying? Every Sunday we hoop, bro. Niggas is always bringing bananas, bro. And it's funny because, like, every time, it's always something that go with that shit. So, like, this nigga eat that shit like this. My nigga got the banana, right? Pause on how I got to make my hand, you feel me? He got the banana, right? He do this. Break the banana off. Shake that bitch like some dice. And then eat it like that. No bullshit, nigga. Hold a banana, break it off, do that a little bit, and eat it. And then he, he look around before he eat it. He be like, now, I don't know when eating a banana became gay, but me, I, I'm i not, see, I'm not doing all that extra shit. If I'm hungry and I need to eat a banana, bro, I'm going to eat the fucking banana, bro. And if I eat it in a way that looks Suspect, what do you want from me, bro? So one day he eating it like that. And I just, like a regular person, I guess, peel the, peel the peel back. Boom, boom, boom. Eat that bitch just like that. Straight off the, straight in. Out. Pause. Out. <laughs> Crushing that joint, right? When I tell you I get niggas niggas is looking at me like jaw dropped. Like, bro, I know you didn't just eat that banana like that. I'm just like, bro, what is wrong with me eating a banana like that, bro? Like, they're like, bro, that's gay. I said, bro, what? They said, y'all know where I said, nigga, you gay. I said, what? Houseway. Cause I ate a banana like how you supposed. I'm like before y'all niggas got in high school and all that shit. Niggas worried about girls. You was in elementary school, huh? Huh? Going crazy on bananas. So let's let's keep it let's let's keep it real for a second, right? Let's keep it real. So I will say, I will admit, 
the way you eat a banana, it's similar to a scar scarf situation. The way you eat a banana, it's a fine line. But eating a banana in general, nigga, I can't have potassium. It's not gay. Straight niggas could do that. Eating a hot dog. This one is probably the more Gen Z form of is this gay or is it not? Because y'all know how these, these Gen Zers are with these the glizzies. That's what they call them. Glizzies. If you eat a if you eat a hot dog, it's a glizzy and you're a glizzy gladiator. You feel me? That's that's what they're saying nowadays. You feel me? And to me, I'm a kid of band. Y'all need to do your research on hot dogs because you shouldn't be eating them anyways. They say that hot dogs really, um, they not good for your health. You feel me? They just not. Like, you can really look them up. Like, they take years off your life like dead ass. Like, this is a fact, not fiction. Um, but, yeah, so these just is, you a glizzy gladiator if you eating this junk. Again, it's similar to the banana. If you eat the hot dog a certain way, you're going to get that bombastic side eye. You're going to get it every time. Niggas going to hit you with the... Or niggas going to be... And this is real crazy. Niggas is so crazy. Niggas will be like this. Niggas will try to get you on camera eating, eating shit in a quote-unquote suspect way nowadays. Bro, y'all got to stop. Again, so f eating a hot dog is straight niggas can do that. All right. So listen, so far, straight niggas, we doing good. Everything on the list we could do right now. I feel like, I feel like it's just, it's cap right now. Next thing, do yoga. Listen, and and because I'm a little seasoned, I got some, I got some age on me. You feel me? Uh. I'ma just I'ma just spit it to y'all real 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 spiel right now because you know what I'm saying a lot of y'all niggas is gonna be you know what I'm saying scoliosis backed and shit when you get older. Do your damn yoga. Do your damn stretches, my nigga. Like who cares about what niggas is saying? Yeah, I, it is some stretches that are questionable. Yeah, there is some yoga. <laughs> there are some yoga stretches. They look questionable. But listen, do your stretches, my nigga. If you have to, you know what I'm saying? Do that. <sighs> that leg stretch. You feel me? Go ahead and get this little. <sighs> Go ahead and get that joint going. You know what I'm saying? Do your yoga, my nigga. Because when you get old, and I'm not even old for real, for real, but I'm 30. When you get my age, bro, that's when your bones start acting. They be acting different. You feel me? Like, you be having to have conversations with your bones. Like, my nigga, why, why you not even letting me jump as high as I used to? Like, what's, what's good with you? You feel me? And it's like, for real, like, you, you need WD-40 on your knees and shit. Because, like, the shit gets real, bro. I'm trying to tell you. So, do your stretches and your yoga now. Because when you get older, up in age, I'm telling you, bro, your legs going to start acting different. They're going to act like they didn't know you for 20 plus years. This is a fact. Yoga is not gay. You feel me? Licking a popsicle. We're going to do licking a popsicle and licking a lollipop at the same time. And if y'all got any comments on this stuff, go ahead and, 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 and comment in the video. You know what I'm saying? But, um... This one, I think, is very much so how you eat it. Because I'm not going to lie. I've seen a gay nigga eat a lollipop. My nigga, eat your lollipop, my nigga. But the way a straight nigga eat a lollipop in a gay nigga is very different. You feel me? Like the gay, I ain't, I, I'm not going to I'm not gonna demonstrate this for clip purposes. You know what I'm saying? Somebody might try to clip me. And then, and they might take it out of context and just have me looking crazy. You know how niggas, you know how people do you nowadays. So I'm not gonna demonstrate how they do it, but y'all know how, how, how they be licking lollipops and shit. You know what I'm saying? And so, if you straight and you going crazy on the lollipop or the popsicle in that diabolical manner, 
I can't defend you. You feel me? Like I, I've come to your defenses. Let me take a look. I've come to your defenses for pretty much everything on this list, but I feel like dumb things. If you eat them a certain way, I can't. I can't represent you. Is the best way to say it. I can't be a lawyer. I can't have your back on this one. You feel me? So that's all I'm saying with that. You're on your own. Next, go to brunch. Bro, I'm just skipping this one. This one's dumb as shit. Like what? Niggas can't eat now? Straight niggas can't eat? Well, we only can eat breakfast or lunch or dinner. We can't combine them shits? Stupid. This one is not even worth talking about. Have, I don't know if I can even say this. Y'all can read it. Have blah, blah, blah with women because men have blah, blah, blah too. <laughs> now this one, this one's interesting because I'm like, I'm, I, I, it, it, it really brings you to think like, what type of nigga came up with this? Yeah, yeah. That's really what you got to think about because it's like, obviously, gay guys, you know what I'm saying? That's what they do. Cool. That's how they get down. That's how they get down. But we got to wonder who was the first straight dude to come up with this level of entry. Like, because it's like, what made you want to do it? I feel like to really understand, we had to delve into the, de the, the the mind of the first the first dude who did that, which we can't. We don't even know who it is. But I'm gonna leave that to y'all, y'all, because I don't I don't do it personally. But I'm a germaphobe, uh, <laughs> so personally, I'm not taking that route. But uh, that's just me. To each his home once again. That's a that's a that's that's an interesting one. I, I will say that's an interesting one. Hang out with male one on one, no friendship. I mean what do you mean by that? No friendship. Why would I be hanging out with him though? I feel like that one needs some some context, you feel me? Because if if I'm hanging out with a male friend one on one, the nigga's my friend. <laughs> like like that's is 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 pretty simple. Like the dude he he's my friend, bro. Like it's no I'm not just hanging out with some random dude. Like, yo, what's what's good with you, my nigga? Yeah, we ain't friends, but I thought you I thought you looked like a pretty pretty cool dude to hang with. So 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 here we are. Huh? Like that don't even make sense. Like no, I don't think nobody's just hanging out with people that they don't that's not their friends anyways, male or female. Next one, dance. Listen, my nigga. I'm a dance with my homies, bruh. If I'ma hit the look, huh, 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 and I'ma hit the huh, 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 the folks with the nigga, I'ma hit the 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 doggy with my niggas. Yeah, you know, I'm I'm dancing with my niggas, bro. I feel like this one needs to be specified. Is it the type of dancing? Because now, if you saying niggas is twerking on each other, obviously that's that's crossing into the to to another realm. But I'm going to hit my nigga. I'm going to grab one nigga on my left, one nigga on my right, and I'm going to hit that swag surf. You feel me? When it comes on in the party. Like, what What are we talking about right now? Like, shit. And if we talking about that new age, that new age shit, when that shit, that, I just want to, I'm going to hit that. I'm hitting that shit with my, with my dog. And you're not gonna call me gay. Cause I'm cause 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 that's that's real nigga shit. Real niggas like to have fun with their dogs, bro. 
If you got real niggas, you understand that. You feel me? So, the dancing shit, cut it. Cut it. Cut it. You feel me? Like, yeah, like, come on, bro. Like, whoever made this list so far, I'm feeling like it might be something going on with yourself. You know what I'm saying? You, you, you trying to project. You feel me? You trying to, you trying to, I don't know, maybe you confused a little bit yourself and you trying to see what, what everybody else is saying. Let's see, well, let's see some, uh, oh, I don't want to comment on this. Um, yeah. So, I don't, I don't, I don't know, bro. Like, so far, come on now. Be active on Twitter. My nigga. What? Now straight dudes can't be on social media? Come on now. Let me get real close to the mic. Come on now. Let's let's be fucking real, nigga. We going to be on social media just as much as gay dudes is on social media, bro. It's fucking social media. It's the world we live in. Like what? Let's be real about it. Let's be let's be real about it, man. So let's go to the next point. Wear a seatbelt. <laughs> hey, nah, I'm fuck. I'm weak. I'm weak right now because of the parentheses. Like my nigga, the parentheses says it's safety for gays. <laughs> Yo, who made this, bro? Who made this list for real? Like, y'all niggas are crazy, bro. No, bro. I'm not going to lie. I don't wear a seatbelt a lot of times. And I should be wearing a seatbelt. I'm not saying that I shouldn't. I should be wearing a seatbelt. But wearing a seatbelt or not wearing a seatbelt don't make you gay, bro. So... Straight niggas, be safe out here, bro. Don't let this list tell you that you're going to be gay if you're wearing a seatbelt. All right? All right, so next. iPads. <laughs> y'all was just bored, huh? Getting, it, getting to the end of the list, y'all are just getting bored, right? We skipping this one. Using a Band-Aid. We're skipping this one. Well, let's, let's just say you might be a little softer if you use a Band-Aid. Most niggas, if, if, if the wound is that little that you can cover it with a Band-Aid, most niggas is just letting it rock. Like, if I got a little slight teeny cut that's mendable with a Band-Aid, I'm not going to say that makes me tough. I just don't feel like what's the need to wrap that bitch and it's a small wound, you feel me? So maybe that just had to do with toughness, you feel me? Ordering an appetizer or a dessert. Yo, I'm not going to lie. It's looking grim for straight niggas. Like, is the, if this list is like real shit, like we, we can't do this shit no more. Like, it's looking real. It's looking real boring being straight. Pause. It's looking real boring, bro. We can't do shit around here. I can't order a Dessert or an appetizer, bro. I got a sweet tooth, my nigga. I cannot not do that. <sighs> Listen. Listen, y'all gonna have to get somebody else to 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 to, to, to do another list. Cause this is crazy. Drinking smoothies is crazy. I can't be healthy. Eating hummus, I don't even know what hummus is. Dead ass. What is hummus? Anybody know what that is? What's hummus? The next one on the list is texting LOL. Now, you know what? This one is funny, too, because I have seen a lot of, like, stuff where people... I have seen this a lot. And it hasn't even really been necessarily with uh, a dip. Hum what are we talking about? Are we talking about hummus? Somebody in the chat said a dip. Is that what that is? What kind of dip is that though? 
You know, I'm a trench baby, so the only dips I know is 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 is, is queso dip or some 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 uh some type of hot sauce dip or some shit. Hummus sounds it it I don't even know what that is, but um yeah, I guess it's a dip though. But I mean, regardless, it don't make you it don't make you gay for eating hummus, my niggas. It's a dip. Okay, got you. For sure, I appreciate that. So yeah, hummus, you cool on hummus though, y'all. You're cool on hummus. So back to the texting though. I've seen a lot of like stuff that dudes so-called can't text this and so-called can't text that, bro. And it'll be like some shit like we can't do the little, you know the little, the little eyes where it's like, it's like the little tears uh, aligning the eyeball. Like they say we can't do that. Uh, shit, we can't do this one. <laughs> I like doing that one. I'm not going to lie. It's funny. Um, it's a lot of text or stuff, emojis or whatnot that we can't uh, supposedly do. LOL to me is nuts. I'm texting LOL every time. I don't care what you're talking about. Like, every time, the LOL is going up. Y'all niggas, and honestly, you don't you don't want niggas to take out the LOL and text. I'm going to keep it a band with you. Because a lot of y'all is just not funny. A lot of y'all is just not funny. You feel me? Like... You're just not. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. So, realistically speaking, I'm not really, I'm not, I'm not worried about that. Like, you feel me? Like, I'm going to say LOL because LOL is just easy to say. And I'm going to do it. Because you can't beat my ass. You feel me? But let's move on to the next one. Because that one was dumb too. Listening to a female artist. I would think this makes you straight, but nope. Okay, so it's clear that the person who made this list is even having reservations. Okay? The person who made the list is having reservations, bro. Um, That's a good question. Like, I mean, that's, that's a good point. Like, you would think it makes you straight. I mean, you're listening to a woman. However... I think the point that I think what they're trying to say is that like if you're singing a type of song, you feel me? So like let's think. What's that what's that sweetie song? Uh six what what is it? Six seven seven figure nigga, that's my type or some shit like that. That's my type nigga, that's my type the that John? I think when they what they're saying on this list is if if I'm driving, you feel me? Lean back, my window down, and I'm at the light like that's my type, nigga. That's my type. That, mm, 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 mm. And then I look to the left, and I just see somebody looking at me because I'm going crazy on this 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 woman song. I ain't gonna lie, that's a little suspect. Like, I, I can't even really defend myself on that one. Like, if I'm legitimately, that's my type, nigga. It's six figure, that, that, that. Or, or, because let's, let's update it a little bit. Because we ice, it, it, ice spices in this bitch now, you feel me? Let's update it. Or, if I'm in that bit like this, I'm like, niggas are eating, he eat it for lunch. I get what I want. Like, damn. Like, you know what I'm saying? If I'm doing that. I'm calling myself a munch, crunch, cat and crunch. I got a hunch that I may be on the border of zestiness. I'm not gonna lie. This this is a this was probably first really good. This it's questionable. I don't think listening to it per se makes you zesty. I think how involved you are with it does. Like if that shit really resonating with you, you might need to you might need to might need to consider some shit. You feel me? Like it's it's possible you need to go take a look in the mirror, you know, reevaluate. All right, what, 
Am I good? Seven nick seven, seven figure niggas is my type. I'm a munch. You feel me? Like you might you might need to reevaluate if that's what's going on. That's all I'm saying. This is a good one. That's a good one. Let's get to the next one. Drinking iced coffee. Snow way. I'm gonna keep it a band. If drinking coffee in general makes you gay, that's a it's a lot of gay niggas out here then. Cause I know a lot of people that drink coffee. If I know people that's addicted to this shit. It's like crack rocks to them niggas. Like they love that shit. You feel me? So if it makes them Damn. You and your mood. <laughs> like what? Let's keep it a buck. But um Using heated seats in your car. This one is funny, like, because I seen some shit. It's funny because I seen another video on TikTok, and this dude was like, that if you a dude and you heat your seats up, you gay. And I just thought to myself, y'all niggas be trying to be so tough for no reason. Nigga, you're not tough. Y'all be trying to be so hard. That is crazy, cause bro, heated seats, my nigga. Listen, I paid fifty five racks for my car, nigga. Fifty thousand dollars cash. Like what? I'm using them heated seats when it's in the and when it's winter time, my nigga. Trust and believe it, and I don't care what you're saying. His his point was what? Because you like your butt to be hot? I said, I most certainly don't like my butt to be cold, sir. So, yeah, I'm going to heat my seats up. You feel me? Like, let's 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 keep it a buck there. Like, that's that's going they're going to be used. I use my money to buy that shit. I'm using the feature. You feel me? Like seats is getting heated. No debate. Argue with your mama. Eating seafood on your birthday. Fuck you. Because <laughs> why the fuck is you worried about what I'm eating on my birthday? And you know what I'm saying? I have eaten seafood on my birthday. I eat seafood not on my birthday. And guess what? It's my favorite food. And I'm straight as an arrow. Straight as a bullet. Straight as... Straight as motherfucking damn, I'm trying to think of a quarterback. Peyton Manning throwing a line drive. Straight as you can shoot a sniper bullet through a hole. But seafood is my favorite food. And I'm and I'm standing by that shit. Cause I love that shit. So, with that being said, that's not gay. Nigga, you can eat seafood, my nigga. And you're straight. Fuck is they fuck is this person talking about? Like, come on, bro. Nigga said, all right, let's go to the next thing. Having lemon in your water. What is having lemon in your water? <laughs> Yo, I'm going to give you a band. I just laughed, though, because I just was thinking about it. And every time I see somebody put lemon, it is a woman. It is a woman doing that. However... If, if my homie wants to put water in his... I mean, if he wants to put a, a lemon in his drink, let him. Maybe he likes that natural lemonade taste. Like, let him. It's nothing wrong with that. So, this is the list, you guys. Um, I believe this is the whole list. Uh, it's unfathomable what uh, most of this list entails. All right, well, I appreciate you guys for tuning in. Um, much love. We going to be right back at this tomorrow, you guys. Uh, I would say probably around, I would say 7. But I'll update my, uh, my app and stuff, let you guys know. 
But I appreciate the support. I'm going to catch y'all in the next stream, next video, whatever the case may be. Y'all have a great Saturday, whatever day it is for you, whatever time it is for you. You have a great day. I'm going to catch y'all in the next one, man. It's your boy Kai for real. And I'm out of here. Peace.